A tumultuous year that resulted in off-season turnover underway at Husky Stadium. And Stanford electing to run this out. Bryce Farrell on the return. And he gets to the 23-yard line. Because of how rabid they've been. Third and eight. McKee, pocket collapsing, down he goes. Braylon Trice with the sack. Here's Talapapa as he slips a tackle, moves the sticks, and gets into Stanford territory. Might have been through the wars. Penix drops back, well protected, and connects with Romo Dunze. Sophomore wide receiver from Las Vegas. Intermediate type of route. 19 yards to the Stanford 24. They send a Dunze in motion. Penix connects short. It's the tight end Jack Westover who's brought down inside the five. First down and goal for the Huskies after a 21 yard gain. A give right up the middle. It's Will Nixon. And the Huskies have liftoff on their first drive of the game. Second down. From the 17, it is off the hands of Filkins and into the hands of Cam Bright. And they gave up unfortunate turnovers. Doink. Interception. And it's all lining up pretty well. The start is Huskies tenure. And he delivers a dart here at the 20-yard line. Odunze turns the corner and gets another five or six out of it. Third down to three. Off play action, Penix connects with McMillan for the first down. Who has not been able to stay healthy his entire college career. All four years at Indiana dealt with injury trouble. But so far, he's received brilliant protection. Here's Talapapa. Into Stanford territory and finally bowled over. Penix on time to Odunze, who scampers away from a couple of tackles and has another Washington first down. See if he connects with Polk here. He's going to go to the right side this time, and it is incomplete. Jackson, the intended target, oh so close from a long of 38 this season. And he drills this one right down the pipe. Third down and six. McKee is sacked to Butala. Casey Filkins, and a fumble! Is this recovered by the Cardinal? McKee lunging after it. But it looked like the Huskies had the first hand on the ball. And it's the same issue for Stanford. They have a mismatch with their receivers and these injured Washington corners. Huskies ball. They just can't get out of their way with these RPOs because it's coming from the side. McKee never sees it. He's comfortable trying to pull that ball back. And Jeremiah Martin, who's been really steady, maybe they're more comfortable going shorter here. They want to score. And the Huskies smelling blood in the water here. They want to go fast. Ala Papa turns on the afterburners. He's gone. On second down, McKee to throw, sideline, got his man, Michael Wilson. And they'll move the chains. Filkins is doing a great job filling the shoes of E.J. Smith tonight. McKee just won for his last four, second down, he'll throw, and he has a wide open target in Michael Wilson. Stanford is on the board. Four straight run plays to start the half for Washington, including that Wildcat snap to Newton. Penix drops back, throws, caught. McMillan at the 30. 
destroyed USC down yeah. in the Coliseum. They're down at eight. Oh, that's putting a receiver in a dangerous spot. Nixon's going to get the flag out of it. There is no foul for targeting. It's an incomplete pass, fourth down. Season long. And it barely sneaks in there. To their own 30 after the great special teams play for the Cardinal. Paddock hands it off to Nixon, who rounds the corner and has a first down. Almost eight and a half yards per rushing attempt. Penix taking a shot into coverage and incomplete. Flag comes in. Contact between Odunze and Caillou Blue Kelly, one of the top pass defenders in the Pac-12. Led the league last year and passes defended. Penix looks to the end zone. And it's caught. Odunze. Spectacular catch. Given him plenty of room to work. Penix looks him off and then goes there. Mm. Great coverage, but man, does he fit it in. Jonathan McGill was right on it. That's a big dude coming at you. Yeah. Trying to go for it here. It's about that time. Down by 20. McKee with a sneak, and he will not get it. Hey, sugarcoated or hand Penix the keys to the car. They they had a full competition, but you know understandably beat out Dylan Morris and Sam Heward for the job. Penix connects with McMillan this time. And it's a first down for the Huskies at the 21. Monty DeMooney lining up at the pass rush here. Protection holds long enough for Penix try to search for something and winds up throwing it away. Prior to 2020, they were ranked inside the top 15 each of the four previous years. Ten consecutive bowl games, get the Rose Bowl last in 2018, and they might be on their way to getting back inside the top 15. Filkins gets the carry. Nice hole created. Right through the gap. Fourth down and four. McKee has the first down. It's Higgins. It's 10 o'clock at night. I don't know. McKee throws. What a grab by Wilson. Like 27 yards. McKee, play fake. End zone. Got his man. Humphreys, you asked for him. And John Humphreys reaches pay dirt early in the fourth quarter. McKee got it. Lines up in the slot here. We'll go five wide, empty backfield. No slant, snap. Penix. Oh boy. Oh, Dunze. With nothing but green in front of him, still on his feet. Wildcat snap here. Newton. And he's caught up in the backfield. Nice penetration from the Cardinal defense and Anthony Franklin. Peyton Henry, three for three tonight. It's hit from as far as 47. And he remains perfect. First down for Stanford at the 37. McKee hangs on to it, and he's going to pay the price. Now the ball came out. But was it before or after the flag? There was no foul on the play. The foul was fumbled, recovered by Washington. First down. The Cardinal has had all night the RPO, and McKee just does not see the rush coming from behind him. It's ZTF again, the junior out of Pearl City, Hawaii. Washington taking over at the 30-yard line after the turnover. Jackson in the backfield, gets the call, bounces off of DeCosmo, but DeCosmo makes a nice recovery. Fourth down and one, I'll go for it. Penix up to the line of scrimmage. 
Hands it off to the tight end, Devin Culp, who rounds the corner. Well, you're talking about the diversity, six different receivers, seven different rushers. Here's Talapapa, who's done the bulk of the work, 122 yards on the ground. Gets pushed back for a loss here by Ricky Mieza. Washington has scored their last four drives. Giles Jackson will make it five straight. Right at the 100-yard mark now as McKee throws. And there's Wilson. And Wilson upfield. Wilson makes a man miss. Will he be able to take this all the way? Yes, sir. They have not slowed down since. That'll do it. Washington will improve to 4 and 0 oh for the first time since 2017. Michael Penix 300 plus yards passing